Comunidad de Rosbrief, estamos en la cobertura del evento Open Marketing 2023 y nos acompaña en este momento Kate Comlova. Kate, muchas felicidades por tu plática. Eh, so, I'm going to speak in English uh, for the interview. Uh, you mentioned something interesting in, at the beginning of the talk that you t that you have of micro influencers uh, about the fear that brands may have uh, by working with these influencers. Uh, what has been the biggest challenge as Dream uh, that has faced and uh, while working with micro influencers and how? Uh, have you overcome it? Yeah, thank you for the interesting question. So from the point of view of uh, markers of brands, the biggest challenge was uh, to make brands believe that micro-influencers still can make nice content, creative content, that will have good lights, good cameras, and etc. And sometimes markets are really, really much afraid about their reputation, about if like we put some like colors that are not supposed to be in the picture. But how we did overcome this, as soon as bloggers start bringing results, brands start understanding more and more that, for example, if I'm a blogger and I always make uh, my videos and stories with very bad lights, and surprisingly for like advertisement, I'll make it with a perfect light, it will not look natural, people will not believe me. So when people see that, uh, since bloggers are making very natural and organic publications, even though they don't look perfect, they gain more results. And actually brands want to attract new clients. And from point of view of bloggers, of course, the main fear of bloggers is that is it a real model? Shall we really have some money? Are you going to pay us? How will we understand? Like, how will we, can we trust you? So, like, the only like way to overcome this fear is to start working to show bloggers the results of other bloggers, because like, yes, some of our bloggers, micro influencers, gain like over ten thousand US dollars for for the, what they do for like just with the results. So as soon as we collect this information in each uh, geo we work, it's easier to convince new bloggers that it's more than possible to uh -huh, That's money. very interesting. Thank so, you. So, um, how does has uh, evolved the working relationship between like the brands and the micro-influencers uh, during the past years? Uh, well, uh, usually brands really don't have enough time and uh, patience to work with micro-influencers themselves. So like the best part of our service is that we cover everything. So we go to brands like psychologists, like real marketing people, uh -huh. and we collect information like what do you really want? Like what is your really, real, real uh, goal, commercial goal? Maybe not only commercial, but media goal. We collect all this information, like what is the perfect portrait of perfect blogger to promote you? We collect this information and then we have between uh, Marcus brands and uh, our uh, bloggers, we have a big team of marketing specialists. We have like education, who are like serious people with big experience in marketing. So we sit all together for every company, for every brand, and we think of, okay, so brands want this, we have this, and we find the ways, like we write these briefs, we find the ways to bring the best for what brands need. And then we go to bloggers and we, how do you say, translate blog, uh, brands' language to bloggers' language so that everybody gets what, like, easy information and the results they want to get. Okay, and to finish this interview, this short interview, um, um, what are the keys like the main things that you have to take into account when you create a campaign uh, with micro-influencers. Yeah, there are some keys. Uh, first of all, yes, we need to understand uh, how much the brand pays for target results. First, even more over, more important, what is the target result? Uh, then what is the typical uh, the portrait of the best blogger? Then what is the bonus for followers? Because to make the company attractive, to make followers really go and make purchases with bloggers' information, we need to give them good coupons, like 20, 25% uh, discount for, uh, for first uh, compras. <laughs> Uh, so, yes, this bonus is very important, geography, of course, like which cities are we working in and, and uh, the, the most, one of the most important things is the uh, uh, Yamada's action, uh, call to actions. Because like if you just say, oh, my name is Kate, I'm a blogger, I like this brand very much, okay, what shall I do? And please go to this website, use my coupon, try it yourself, text me how, you, how did you like this brand. So, okay. uh, Yamada Paraxion is 
is super important. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, thank you, Kate. Thank you. <laughs> thank you for being here and thank you for the interview. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>